What's going on everyone, it's Big Wes here. Did a full body barbell workout today. Really good, I was happy with how the form was looking. So here's exactly how the workout went. All right, so we did a full body barbell workout today. Honestly, it's straightforward. Been doing the reps and sets, everything looking nice. I was very happy with how the squats were looking and that issue with the deadlifts before with my leg pinching, I adjusted and went to basically like a snatch grip and that got rid of all the leg pain. So very happy with that. And uh, it's something that I'm going to have to work on. So I'm looking forward to getting better at that. But aside from that, uh, the workout was just regular. So I want to talk about body dysmorphia today like honestly it is real but as long as you're aware of it it can't hurt you like i personally right now i'm feeling like fat i look at myself and I'm like, oh man I'm getting fat but one i know i'm not following a diet right now so obviously that's just going to happen if you're not tracking you're not like taking care and eating just out of control you're going to put on weight but i'm stronger as well and then i had literally two people tell me today yo wes you're looking Looking big, you're looking huge, like you're pumped up. So yes, in your perspective, you are fatter, you're looking bigger, but to everyone else, you are looking more muscular. So both are true, uh, but who do you wanna to listen to? The voice in your head saying, oh, it's all negative or the positive reinforcement that you're getting. And like, yes, you have to take in a bit of both, but what is more productive? Because at the end of the day, like the negative voice is just negative, not productive. Like it's a lie in that sense. So you are in charge of how you react it's up to you and if you want to take in the version of reality where it's like yeah you're just getting fat fine go with that but you could also look at it as like yeah i'm getting muscular getting stronger and there's always someone else who wishes you were in they were in your position like even if you're fat as hell and you went to the gym and worked out there's another fat person like man at least he's getting it done so you don't know who you're motivating you don't know what's going on just get in there and do what you got to do but uh yeah it's kind of my a little motivation thing today so uh that's it for that so just enjoy the reps and sets and then hit the subscribe button and i'll see you guys at the end of the video
All right, so that was the video. So like I said, mental illness is a lie. Yes, it's real, but it's lying to you and you are in charge of how you react and how you control that and you can master it. Like, don't let it hold you back. It could be a tool that you use to motivate you or it could be the tool of your own destruction. So with that being said, just get in there and do what you need to do. Uh, like, yeah, like I said before, I was happy with the form. Squats were looking nice. Hammies are coming out. So uh, I'm happy with the little details, but uh, I am looking forward to start dieting and seeing the work that I've put in for like the past year and a bit really pay off. Uh, but yeah, that's it for right now. So like and share this video with a friend. Drop some comments so I know what you guys are saying. Hit the subscribe button, ring the notification bell so you know exactly when these videos come out, when the live stream is up and you guys can participate in all that. So rest, eat, sleep, recover, do everything you need to do to be ready for the next workout. Planning on doing one tomorrow and then rest for a weekend so that is it so thank you guys for watching i appreciate it as always i'll see you next time peace out